Hello, Gemini, getting ready to do your reading. This is for that one special person, someone you have a mutual, uh, there's mutual love between the two of you. Maybe you guys have talked about the future together. So let's see what is going on in this connection for the two of you. Overall energy is eight of coins work or working on this connection, how your person feels, the five of wands, what might be holding this connection back, the two of coins. In the hidden position, you may not see the six of coins and in the possible future outcome, the nine of coins. Wow, a lot of coins, five of coins. It's under the deck. Okay, so Gemini, what is going on with you and your person? Your outcome's good. I think someone just needs to make a decision here. I don't know if your person's overwhelmed or confused or what they're doing, but what is Eight of Coins as the overall energy for this connection for Gemini? King of Wands, the Knight of Coins, and the Star card. So you could be dealing with a fire sign or an earth sign, maybe an Aquarius, but your person, your person's passionate here. They're just moving maybe a little slow, maybe a little slower than what you were hoping, but they're on the right path of the Star card. How you, how your person feels, the Five of Wands, the Wheel of Fortune, the Page of Swords, and the Page of Wands. Maybe the two of you just aren't getting along right now. Maybe it's the two of you bickering. Page of swords, you. Page of wands, them. Maybe you guys are just in a disagreement right now about something. It could be anything. So maybe your person's frustrated right now because this is how their energy is. Five of wands. So it may not be you. It could be them. Maybe you need to just kind of stay, take a step back. All right. Because they may be feeling kind of combative right now or like they're just frustrated overall. Maybe work is frustrating them. But um, now if it's not the two of you arguing, it could be with anybody, you know. So what is the two of coins? This is what's holding things up. The page of cups, the ace of cups, and the three of swords. Five of wands under here also. Now, I don't know if your person is having a hard time making up their mind about what to do in this connection. I don't know. Maybe I'm reading it backwards. Maybe it's your energy. But either way... This may have something to do with work. Maybe both of you work. Maybe both of you have really good jobs and you guys don't want to like move. I've, I've done readings like that. Both people have a good job, but they're in different states. Well, what do you do? It, it's, it's hard to know what to do. So there could be something like that. It could be a family issue. One of you has kids, so you can't move. So what is the three of swords? One more for that. The six of wands. See, I see it being overcome. I see whatever this issue or problem is, it seems to be working out maybe one of you can get a transfer if it's a job or what is the six of coin and what's hidden hanged man ace of coin yeah and the two of cups there will be a compromise in this connection gemini whether it's you or them this is what's hidden the six of coin some sort of money's coming in or um i just got the, got the word advice i know that's not six of coins but maybe it's a lawyer maybe someone hires a lawyer because they need advice but there is a there is a solution there is a perfect solution for this. And again, that's why the Six of Wands. So if you're seeing this connection as it's not going right, things are um, getting in the way, your person is actually very optimistic. It's just right now it's hard to not argue about this because I feel like you are both are passionate about the outcome. What is the Nine of Coins here? What is the Nine of Coins? Knight of Swords, the Ten of Wands. The five of wands, maybe one more, the five of coins. There are some major changes going on here in the Hierophant. So you're going to get there. You are going to get there, Gemini. So whether it's you or them, uh, look at that. It's like he's moving. He's carrying everything on his back. There's arguing here. I guess some of you are moving down the way and you guys will be arguing about where things go. Don't let anything bother you. Right now, you may even be in separation. You may be even feeling the five of coins. It's going to turn around. It's going to be okay. Look, the Six of Wands is under the Five of Coins also, and the Hierophant, and the world. So maybe you guys had plans, and then all of a sudden something happened. Maybe an ex got involved, or your person just seems to want to argue all the time. This is showing things are going to be okay. Now, again, this can also mean you just spending time on your own. Maybe there's just a little space that's needed until the resolution comes in. What is the Five of Coins that was under the deck? Strength card, the Seven of Cups, and the Knight of Wands. Don't let your imagination get the best of you. Whenever I see like Seven of Cups and the Knight of Wands, maybe your person, you feel they're dating other people. One more for the Knight of Wands. Or you are the sun. Yeah. You may think your person is dating other people. They are not dating anyone serious when the Seven of Cups shows up and the Knight of Wands. Um, I, I don't think that's going on, though. With those cards, what's the two of cups here? Four of swords. 
there's a lot of love here between the two of you. Some of you, there's someone here viewing you definitely on a break. You guys are definitely not speaking right now. You're feeling really bummed out about the situation, the arguing. Is that maybe it's not been nonstop. What is this page of wands? Maybe some, maybe someone is feeling really emotional. This could be you or them. They could be a water sign. Maybe it's about a water sign. Maybe someone's getting involved. Um, page of coin. You maybe okay now this would have already happened so again maybe there was something a, an ex or someone a child because six of coin can be um, paying past bills paying child support paying alimony paying for something that might have also got involved and caused things to come to a grinding halt for someone that won't apply for like all of you obviously but if not. I just see with the moon, it may be the moon cycle. Someone may be feeling really emotional right now. And there could be an apology though. This this deck, it reminds me of someone apologizing. Maybe you're with an earth sign. It doesn't need to be, of course. Pisces energy is here. Maybe it's a Pisces. But I feel like things things will calm down. There's just a lot going on with the energy right now. The moons, the planets, the earth, what's going on just in general. I think it's just a very volatile time for a lot of people there's a lot of stress and people are feeling that stress so i don't want to say take it with a grain of salt but definitely maybe try to look past some of it because it seems to be that it's going to work out give this person some space um, hopefully they give you space if this is you i'm describing okay love see that just popped right out yeah, there's love between the two of you. Unconditional love, self-love, oneness, passion, affection, and attraction. So, of course, take good care of you. Take good care of yourself. That was the clock. It wanted to fall out. That's probably important because that talk is about needs some time. It's taking time. But um, engagement ring. So I'm getting some of you will get back together. Maybe you were planning a wedding or you're planning to get engaged or something along that line. You can also talk about partnership, commitment, and dragonfly. Be lighthearted. Finding out things coming to light, adapt, change, and heal. Some of you also, you guys could be starting a new business. Some of you may get seed money here, but you don't see a seed money coming in for a new business or something new that you want to start. I get something to do with soaps for some reason, but um, yeah, this could be working on a you know a business, a partnership, something like that. Yeah, I'm getting for somebody. Maybe you want to make more money and you want to change the direction of what you're doing. Uh, you will find some information online. You will, you could get a loan, so I'm picking up, or some angel money or something along that line. And I guess something really good is going to come out of this, this argument or this period. Something that's going to benefit you. You working on yourself. You not um, putting so much focus on this connection and doing something that, that really makes you happy and you're going to be, you know, glowing. But what does... Gemini need to know about this connection. What does Gemini need to know about this? Trust. Crystal Cave, number nine, trust. Under the deck is playfulness. These cards are coming out for couple signs, but I feel it's the energy. It's like lighten up, trust everything will be okay. Have a little bit more of a playful energy. Let me see what spirit would like you to do or know. These cards are for creating your dream life. What would you like Gemini to know? Make a mission statement for your soul. So what is it that you truly want? What is it that you want to create for yourself? Because I'm getting that is important right now about like mapping out your future as well as uh, the future with this person. Some of you definitely want to be mothers or fathers and you want children. And I do see that here. Some of you may adopt also. If that has been your dream to adopt a child or a couple of children or foster or something. I'm also seeing that with that page of coin in the moon. But for others of you, yeah, what is it? Have you been wanting to be an entrepreneur, work on your own, have your own business or company? Because I can see that happening here also. Let me see if there's something your person might want to say to you. Some of you that maybe you're in separation or you're not talking, you guys are mad at each other. I hide my feelings. Well, that's not good because it's very hard to understand what they're feeling. Again, this could be you, Gemini, but... Is this them? Is it hard to know what they're thinking and feeling because they're not opening up? They're not explaining what it is they want? Is that where their confusion lies? 
I feel like they're not explaining their side of it. Maybe they want more freedom or they don't want to move to a particular place or something, but I would do it all again. So they would do this again. This isn't lost. There's something here about um, wanting to go back or doing it again. I replay our conversations over and over. Definitely could be an apology if that one resonates because that is that does sound like separation and five of wands and going back over the past and what was said and someone definitely did open up though the queen of cups i feel like you were very open and maybe they weren't i'm going to extend this one i've been extending all of these so i will extend yours to see uh what else they're thinking and feeling for you i think we'll go a little deeper in how they're feeling about this connection with you so I'm going to put the link below, Gemini. Have a great week, and I will talk to you soon.